And what a year it's been. Between a global pandemic, civil unrest, and a presidential election, some things were put on hold this year. Our Barrett Leone joins us live in the studio after speaking with city leaders today to find out where the city's headed after an unpredictable year. Barrett. Well, Caitlin, like so many other parts of post-pandemic life, the Med City isn't necessarily returning to normal a year and a half after the first U.S. COVID-19 case, but rather a pivot into a new normal. Pre-pandemic times, Mayor Norton says one of her goals, actually a campaign promise, was resiliency and sustainability. But in the thick of the pandemic, what became important was the success, health, and well-being of the people who live in Rochester, the businesses that were struggling, and the homeless population that had no where to go. Mayor Norton says that's where the city council pushed CARES funding towards. And while the Resiliency and Sustainability Task Force continued their work throughout the year, Norton says it's those priorities that continue to take precedence coming out of the pandemic. We did shift focus a little bit, saying maybe our city should do more about economic development moving ahead. You know, we support Ready and we, you know, give a little money here and a little money there, but maybe that should be a bigger focus for us. Um, supporting our businesses, supporting our people who need work. And so that definitely has been a shift for us. While some aims for the city may be changing, city leaders tell us there's one thing that stayed consistent throughout the pandemic year, and that's innovation. Tonight at 6, we'll hear from Destination Medical Center. Caitlin.